Hi, good morning friends. Uh, this is Parish Ranjan Raut. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to explain to you what is different between commit and auto commit in detail. Okay, this video is a very most important video for technical student as well as non-technical student and also who is working as a professional and who is a beginner student as a fresher student. Definitely it will be helpful for you. Please watch this video till end. Definitely it will make constant to you also. Uh, let's uh, discuss with our important keywords. Okay, exactly uh, what is meaning of uh, commit and auto commit? Let's you can think it uh, just commit means permanently and auto commit means temporary as I mentioned here. Okay, if you are uh, getting confused a lot, I'll uh, let uh, let's make it easy to understand. I'll give you an example for commit syntax. Okay, just a minute. If uh, let's your manager uh, given to you assign to you some projects, some projects. Okay, ki uh, Bishwaranjan, uh, please update our uh, new project and new data. Okay, ki update in your databases. Okay, as per your manager instructions, what you did, you are just uh, follow your manager instructions and you are updated. You are making changes permanently in your databases. Okay, and uh, it cannot roll back that's called commit exactly what is uh, mean by rollback means uh, you cannot accessible whatever you did changes in your databases and whatever you did uh, modify whatever you did update with your databases even you are trying to do uh, access with your previous data even you are not able to do that's called uh, auto and that's called actually commit means uh, you cannot accessible with your exist data and uh, that's called uh, commit. I hope you are understood. Okay. Same to same opposite of commit. Auto commit is temporary. Means like uh, whatever you doing operations, whatever you are performing uh, operations with your databases, it, it is just for temporary only. You, whatever you uh, saving, whatever you are save databases, whatever you updating data. Okay. As per a manager instruction, after you saving also, after you save all data in your database, and uh, previous data you can roll back you can view you can update okay you can optimization you can uh, exec uh, execute also your query and you can accessible also with your previous data that's called auto commit okay i hope uh, you are getting understand so this is the most major keyword for commit and auto commit okay if you are uh, still getting confused please uh, drop me comment for which uh, point you are getting confused definitely i'll desert to you i hope this video will be help to you if this video you thinking this video is helping to you a lot please uh, do subscribe my youtube channel and uh, share share this video with your friends definitely it will be uh, make motivation for me thank you thank you so much